Uh, welcome to the lineup. Uh, we have a delicious Asian uh, inspired menu. Uh, yeah, let's start off with the proteins. Black pepper chicken, guys. Uh, this is chicken that was marinated in soy, um, a lot of black pepper, salt, garlic, ginger. We uh, sauteed it up and then we did like a black pepper sauce. Um, tamari, ginger, garlic, you get salty, you get the little heat from the pepper because we added so much to it. Um, has peppers, uh, actually green, green bell peppers, uh, red bell peppers, Chinese long beans, onions. Um, yeah, very savory dish. Uh, moving on. Then we got the Singapore style roasted spicy cod. Uh, really good dish right here, guys. Um, really happy how it came out. We did a Singapore marinade on the on the cod. Uh, sambal, uh, tons of uh, garlic already cooked down with the garlic oil. Um, tamarind, uh, ginger, garlic, and like like half of it's just straight scallion, just like pureed into the to the marinade. Um, we roasted it off. And then we did the same uh, type of marinade, but we made like a glaze for it and drizzled it over once uh, it was cooked. And then we tossed it with some um, cremini mushrooms, baby bok choy, and onions as like type, like the garnish. Um, yeah, I, I think everyone's going to be really happy with how the crowd came out. Uh, then we got our vegetarian entree, tofu and, tofu and spicy sambal curry. Uh, we used like yellow curry paste and we used sambal. You got, it definitely has some heat to it. Um, has peppers, onions, uh, nice and tender tofu. Um, yeah, cilantro, scallions in it. I like it. Oh, this is coming with the peas and asparagus also, guys. That's Kinsen on the side. You guys get that? Uh, pack out people. Did you guys get peas and asparagus for a garnish? Yes. Did I see that one? Yes. Yes, perfect. Double check you guys. Throw that in there. We send it to you guys on the side because... Um, oh, wait. One of these No, I'm not really sure. I, I was going to say I didn't see that. Okay. Before, we'll figure this one out. Before you guys leave, they're going to whip up some peas and carrots, most likely. Asparagus. Most likely. Asparagus. Uh, My bad. Asparagus and peas. Peas and carrots. Peas and carrots. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that one. We'll offline about it. Uh, then we got uh, coconut yellow curry noodles right over here, guys. Uh, we did uh, also yellow curry uh, paste base uh, with garlic, uh, lots of ginger, shallots, and then we uh, used coconut milk, so it's it's vegetarian for sure. Uh, this is like a really good base for the chicken or for the tofu. A lot of flavor in it. Um, yeah, everyone loves noodles. Uh, then we got the crisp guy line right over here. We tossed it with uh, some fried garlic, toasted sesame seeds, a little sesame oil, um and garlic nothing crazy uh just a really simple dish uh it's really crispy uh it's really refreshing so it should be nice to, you know part of these dishes are all saucy and kind of heavy and then we got the broccoli carrot and cabbage salad that's going like a fermented tofu uh dressing that we made with like maple so it's like it has like that pungent flavor but it's like sweet uh it's salty um yeah, should be good. Uh, let's go over garnishes. You're gonna get the red uh, Fresno chilies or the chicken. All right, guys. Red cabbage for the tofu as usual. And this is also getting peas and asparagus. Peas and asparagus. Yeah. Write that down, please. Peas and asparagus, y'all. Scallions and cilantro for the noodles. And uh, since we have some extra cilantro, let's put some on the fish too, just to make it pop a little. So use, use some of the cilantro for the fish, guys. All right, questions? Do you want us to uh, fold in the pieces here again? Yes. Or just put it over? No, you got to fold them in uh, for sure. Thank you. Any other questions? Bell peppers. Peppers, peppers. Bye-bye. <laughs>